Thank you, Vicki. Huge earthquakes rocking the South Pacific this afternoon, but thankfully no tsunamis tonight. Three quakes, all greater than seven in magnitude, hit just near the island nation of Vanuatu late today. Now, just last week, a quake triggered tsunami killed nearly 200 people in Samoa. And while the quakes are thousands of miles away, the Bay Area sits on the same east side of the Pacific Plate, just another stop on that ring of fire. NBC Bay Area's Gene Ellie is live on Treasure Island, and Gene seismologists now think they know which fault will be at fault in the next Bay Area quake. Jessica, scientists say history is telling them that the Hayward Fault is due for a big earthquake. Now that fault runs through most of the East Bay and damage is expected to be widespread. Here you go. So that's the rupture front right there. A simulation of a magnitude 7 earthquake on the Hayward Fault shows widespread violent shaking over much of the East Bay. Seismologists say history indicates the Hayward Fault is due for a large earthquake. There's very good evidence that suggests that every 140 years, give or take, um, we have a big earthquake on this fault. Well, the last time was in 1868. So if you add 140 years to 1868, it's 2008. So essentially, we're right in the window. Dozens of people came out for a science cafe talk about the Hayward Fault in Berkeley tonight. Most want to know what to prepare for. I'm trying to set if I should get earthquake insurance and if I should do anything. Oh, all the UC Berkeley seismologist Kevin Maeda says prepare for serious movement. The Hayward Fault runs right through densely populated areas. You have lifelines such as water and power and gas that cross the fault, not to mention freeways that will undoubtedly be damaged. So. There'll be a lot of problems. Recent large earthquakes along the west side of the Pacific Plate in places like Samoa left entire regions devastated. The Bay Area is on the east side of the same plate, a plate that is on the move. With the 20-year anniversary of the Loma Prieta earthquake approaching, scientists are urging people all over the Bay Area to be prepared. Now, experts say we should all have earthquake kits in the car and at home, but Maeda also suggests keeping an old pair of tennis shoes under the bed, something easy to grab when you're on the run, something to protect your feet from broken glass and debris. Reporting live on Treasure Island, Ginelli, NBC Bay Area News. Okay, thank you.